If I were you, I'd eat a bunch of poo. Roll it in a ball and put it in my pants. Hey, I've just eaten my own poo, but it previously was your own poo. If I were you. Go, Jake. <laughs> yeah. Uh, <clears throat> Yo, if I were you, I'd eat your pee. You're not me. Why would you eat pee? Can I have pee? Why can't you see? Let's drink pee. Thomas's pee. Now it's Amir's turn. <laughs> <laughs> if I were you, don't eat anything. Don't go to the mall with Scooby-Doo. Don't solve some mysteries with a Mr. P or a Mr. T. Because I pity the fool who doesn't go to school. So stay in school. And that's our rap. Stay in school. Thank you, Welcome everybody. Welcome to the show. Uh, a little explanation. If you're listening at home, we're no recording. need to explain anything. Okay, <laughs> let's get started. <laughs> that made sense to everybody. Uh, we're recording this at South by South by Southwest in Austin. A uh, few people to thank Thomas for this is his idea. This whole thing is your your yeah, brainchild. Yeah, here we are uh, coming at you live <laughs> from no, the no, South by no. Southwest. No, 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 no. Only didn't thank you. Okay, he so didn't tell you to introduce anything. Premium <laughs> platinum just, lounge. Just say what up at the Vimeo no, Hut. <laughs> So let's okay. Let's start that again. I'm gonna All say right. thank you, Thomas, and you say yeah. Yeah, yeah. Thanks, it's good thanks to be here. here. Thanks to be here. <laughs> Reggie Watts okay. coming out later. You didn't say that. Right. You didn't say what we told you to say. Okay. Uh, thank you to Vimeo for housing us. This whole studio is their creation. They're paying for it. We're not paying anything. Um, <laughs> Thank you to Vimeo's money. Yeah. Hey. Uh, Alex Sexton, who brought the microphones and camera to help uh, record this whole thing. So thank you, Alex. He wanted me to give a shout out to his dog. His dog, Batman. Yes. Batman? And then also... Uh, oh, Batman, not Batman. Batman. That wouldn't make any sense if it was Batman. Well, you know, okay. uh, dachshunds have uh, back troubles. Is he a dachshund? Well, if he was, and maybe he had back troubles, you'd call him Batman. <laughs> yeah. Uh, also, thank you to Bethany. And remind me the website one more time. Lost in Reviews. Lost in Reviews. Uh, we tweeted that we needed cameras and microphones, and Bethany was the first one to get back to us. So thanks, behold. Bethany. Thank you. Word. Um, all right. What is this? What are we doing here? This is just a classic if I were you. Yeah. Set in the premium platinum Vimeo <laughs> hut no. here at South no, no, by no, no, Southwest. No, no. Later on, we got Reggie Watts. Uh, <laughs> we don't no, we have got the ghost here. of Don Galloise <laughs> coming at you. <laughs> I fear you're over-promising, and we're going to oh, deliver. We, we deliver. Uh, this is an advice podcast. Uh, so we get emails to if I were you show at gmail.com. People are... Uh, in need of our advice and sometimes Jake and I give it and sometimes we have a friend yeah. and sometimes that friend is T middle ditch T squiddle snurch <laughs> I can't wait to T sink squiddles let's do it see <laughs> I can't wait to sink my teeth into a good helping of, of advice you're good you like you like you like the advice part of the show I do yeah because I like it it's just us girls and guys ch chatting and gabbing yeah, not chatting <laughs> gabbing chilling chilling maxing yeah relaxing all cool uh, we're recording this on video, too, so if, if you want to watch it later in this week, we're going to put it on our YouTube channel. Are we going to be able to watch the whole thing or just little bits and bobs? The whole fucking thing. No, 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 nasty. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait. F -f -f Filthy. <laughs> <laughs> That's perfect. It's funny when it cuts off early. <laughs> Can you make any beat with that thing? Or? Uh huh. All right, let's get started. Um, <laughs> as long as they already made it over there. Yeah. yeah. And he oh, just actually, says, I can try press pressing button. other buttons. Here we go now! Here we go now! <laughs> it's disgusting! Get filthy! All your raps are about getting filthy. Yeah, and man. And eating poop. Yeah, dude. <laughs> like, it's not even get filthy, like, sexual. It's like, get yeah. filthy, roll up poop and pee. And pee. Yeah. yeah, man, get nasty. <laughs> it's really gross, though. Ain't nobody got time for that. <laughs> hey Rodney, it's just a bit um tush. Okay, it's just a bit um tush. Got it, here we go. No, because it doesn't work. If sure. I do a joke. Gotta gotta got it. You know. Here we go. Well let me just wait for the joke. For okay. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, I'm not, <laughs> hey, that's way too early. <laughs> okay. And B, B and B, it's not just but um tish, okay? No, that's tish tish boom boom tish. <laughs> okay, it's a lot of tish tish. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, okay, right. here we go. Sure. Uh, a nun, a priest, and an alligator walk into a bar. Ouch! <laughs> you gotta wait for the. There was a I did, I did, I did. I heard, I heard ouch, which I think was the punchline, right? No, okay. A nun, a priest, an alligator walk into a bar. Ouch! 
That's <laughs> very close, but surprisingly So close. I have the job. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yes. All right. You want to no answer other some applicants. questions? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Just jump right in. Um, Did we explain right. what it was? We asked, oh, yeah. We answer questions. Yeah. Well, I think I did that. All right. Good. Uh, this is, isn't this episode 400? This is officially episode 400. <laughs> we skipped 320 episodes <laughs> over here. Uh, all right. Uh, okay. We need a guy's name. Thomas, can you give us a guy's name? Oh, um, Marvin uh, <laughs> Sholgowitz. <laughs> Your lawyer. My lawyer, CPA. <laughs> <laughs> hey guys, here's the problem. I'm a 21 year old Welsh lad, and I've been best friends with my brother from another mother for several years. We grew up as kids together, and to be honest, I love that son of a bitch. Hmm. However, I live in Wales, and he moved to London a while ago, and every time he visits Wales or I go to London, we always meet up and go for a pint or a bite to eat. But recently, he's got a girlfriend. Now, don't get me wrong, she's a lovely girl, but that bitch is stealing my best bud. The last two times he's been down to Wales, I've barely seen him. The most recent of which, he didn't even text me to say he was down here. We made plans to do stuff like two weeks before he headed down, but when he came, it was nothing but radio silence. Help me out, guys. What am I supposed to do? Love, Solomon Schulskowitz? Uh, Marvin? Marvin, Marvin Schulskowitz. Schulskowitz. Yeah. Oogie boogie. It just put him to Sure. Absolutely. <laughs> Oh. Uh, have you ever encountered such a thing? I've been that guy. Which guy? Marvin or his friend? Marvin, where it's like, hey, where, where my friend Why go? are we hanging out? Yeah. I've never but then again, it. I've also been the other guy. Right. And when you're the other guy, you're like, oh, the uh, Marvin's like, being a wiener. Like, right. I, I well, like a girl. A, that was where I just went. Marvin's a little bit of a wiener. Oh. I would the, want to tell him to relax. Do, am I alone? N- n- well, you would want to, and, you, and you're and you okay in saying that. Appreciate that. Thank but, you. you know, you got to... Take care of Marvin's feelings because Marvin misses you. Misses. Oh, all right, cool. Um, so I'll be the. I'm the friend. <laughs> I'll be Marvin. All right. I'll be uh, Welsh. Yeah, this <laughs> so is a classic we- Welsh. So, so we're in Wales. <laughs> yeah. Uh, <laughs> uh, hey, I miss you. <laughs> 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 oh, yep. you think Welsh people are just cavemen <laughs> from London? I guess. Well, do you guys hibernate when you have girlfriends? Isn't that a, a common thing? Like, once yeah. you were in a relationship, it's like, oh, I, I haven't seen my friends you, in six you months. You hunker down. You hunker down for they just a little up. bit. You, you don't go away forever. You go in. Yeah, just for six months where you get to know everybody and alienate all... Or it, you get to know one person and alienate all your friends, and then yeah. you come out of your hibernation. hibernation. Because he's also got double duty with, with uh, Johnny Awesome going yeah. to London town. Well, here's the problem. I clean them chimney can't. sweeps. You have <laughs> Johnny Awesome going to London Town. <laughs> yeah, double man. duty. Yeah, double duty. God, you're cool. Yeah. You have, <laughs> teach me how to talk. I teach you how to speak to you. You have the problem is you have a new girlfriend and an old best friend, and who would you rather let down? Probably the old best friend because he's like, I'm committed. I'm invested. Yeah. I'm, I have I have like a history with this friendship. So you can let down your old friend and he'll still be there. You can't let down your new girlfriend. Yeah. That's like a very fragile, it's like an injured bird. Yeah, and yeah. the injured Bjork. Bjor- oh, <laughs> injured Bjork. <laughs> the injured Bjork. That, that's it's a dangerous, dangerous attitude sweet. to have to be like, I can let down my old friend because he'll always be there. But well, bro's got to understand. No, bro's understand. Bro's got to understand. Right, that's what I'm saying. I'm more, more along with lines of like, this guy needs to shape up and be like, supportive of his friend in the relationship because he doesn't have a giner and the girl does oh that's so a major it's... difference between him and the girl how's that well <laughs> do you want to i guess have you guys not talked about this yet? um google vagina on your phone what is that <laughs> v-a-g google vagina is that an app siri <laughs> siri google, google vagina show your, siri show me your vagina <laughs> Oh my God! It's the lady who plays Siri. Jesus. She's done softcore porn. She's beautiful. <laughs> well, also, I feel like Marvin might have an interesting new perspective should he finally meet a dame or a lass, as he might say in Wales. <laughs> I've been sad for four months. Of oh course, God, I'm so sorry to hear that. Um, <laughs> you really sorry? He meets a lass, and sure. suddenly he's like. Oh, now I'm entertained in the lady. Yeah. So Welsh. he's Jamaican? <laughs> yeah, Welsh. And, right. um, and then he might, he might gain some perspective because it's nice to fall in love, especially with a pretty, pretty lady with yeah. the tatas and the titis. <laughs> it's hard, isn't it? It's to, hard. I to, mean, I think we've all been in love with ladies with titis and tatas. Uh, yeah, sure. I, I guess I've been in love with a For lady sure. with titis and tatas. But it's hard to balance that new relationship with old friendships. 
Do you just ignore your? I think friend? as no. a friend, you have to be like, you know what? I accept what you're going through, and you take a step back. You're like, my friend's gonna disappear for a couple months to a year, and then I'll then a I'll year. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> Yeah. A year flies by. He barely sees this dude anyway. They only yeah, hang out in moved. Wales. They should have broken up months and years ago. <laughs> they only see each other a couple times a year in Wales. That's fine. Forget it. You're you, done. They're not your friend. friend anyway. I think so. So what's your advice to this guy? Get over it or have a talk with your friend? You Definitely can bring don't a, have a talk. Oh, bring, it's such a weird thing for a guy to have a talk with me about a friendship. Like, that I'm hey, ignoring. man. <laughs> We don't see enough enough of each other. I've had that talk given to me, and it is awkward. I think if you ever have that talk, you should bring it up at, like uh, as if you were a construction worker. Like, right, yeah, hey, bro, what, come on, we gotta them. hang out. You don't, a just, you don't bit sit more. down and say, "Hey, I have something to talk to you about." Yeah, I yeah, see yeah. You, no, auntie, don't you do that, joke. please. Wait, what was that? <laughs> no, auntie. <laughs> no, no, <laughs> no, please. That's also Welsh. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, wait, you believe that's Malaysian. So you mean just tell <laughs> just tell your friend that in a joke way rather than actually sitting down and having a, a I don't rhythm. think you don't even need to do a joke and you can do it real but just don't be like hey man we need to talk like that's <laughs> no bueno then, then suddenly he's in another relationship with a male friend platonically <laughs> nah. not worth it well it's worth it you can have heart to hearts you can have heart to hearts with your male friends I don't know. Any, eh. if someone tried to have a heart to heart with me I'd be like no really I don't. I think so. <laughs> Wait, let me check. Yeah, I'm sure of it. I would not have a heart to heart with a friend. You'd never have a heart to heart. I think I definitely deflect it. You host a show where it's advice about <laughs> potential personal problems that are deep and affected, and you'll never have a heart to heart. You're right. You're right. You're right. You guys talk. I'm gonna retreat into myself for a second. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I'm I'm too. I'm like kind of uh, incapable of being emotionally intelligent enough to have a very serious heart to heart with a male counterpart. You guys, that's actually put the beat back on. Heart to heart with the male counterpart. <laughs> we Whoa. spent too much time apart <laughs> being my male counterpart. It's like when you have a heart to heart. Is this crazy? This turned into like slam poetry. <laughs> that's what Jake's really good at. <laughs> Because I can't do anything to a beat. Yeah, and you can't go fast enough. Slam poetry is like you for rappers. At, you yeah. winked at me right now. You can't go fast enough. You know what I mean? <laughs> Hello. I'm All right, here. Let's, let's answer the next question. Wait, wait, That's wait, it. You're still dead to us. See, what's this, is what, I'm, this <laughs> is what I'm talking about. He's incapable of opening You can't up. open up to me. I'm a sociopath. You would, you would say get over it? Bottle yeah. up your emotions inside and just you'll see oh, your friend man. in a year? Yeah, I think everything's going to work out fine. You do great in that steel mill we've been talking about. <laughs> oh, nice. <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't even tell it was an insult to you guys high five. <laughs> That's not a high five, you ding dong. <laughs> <laughs> now go join the baseball team or get out of my lawn. <laughs> get out of my lawn? Yeah, man, it's enclosed. You think I'm going to leave this up to the sun? <laughs> ding dong. It could be enclosed and still be Stop. under the You're sun. You're both out of here. You know what? Both of you <laughs> join the baseball team. You're it calling everybody be ding dongs all day. Out of my lawn or I'm calling the coppers. <laughs> I'm out of your lawn. <laughs> <laughs> But I'm Tish. That's all it is. <laughs> Absolutely. And I will for the next one. Um, uh, well, I don't know. I, th I well, think well, how about, if what it's would really you eating if, you up. If, you were, if I were you, if I were you, what would you do? Okay. You had a if friend, it, great friend. He had a lady friend and he just didn't see, he didn't call you when he visited LA. If it was, if it was this truly, is such a truly sensitive bugging position me. to put yourself in. Like if I had a friend, <laughs> if I had a friend and they were like, hey, we don't, or, wait, fuck. If I had a friend and he got a girlfriend and they didn't see me any, anymore, I would just be like, fine. That's, That's okay. There's yeah. no friend yeah. that you would talk I, I to. I would go and make another friend. But do you say that now? <laughs> Will you, you be my friend, sir? I lost my friend. Maybe my other you're... friend's being a ding dong. Well, so now look, you're a handsome, charming man with oodles and oodles of confidence. Appreciate that. Appreciate that. Amir, what do you have to say about me? N n we're just <laughs> okay. You're also older, a little wiser. This man's 21. No. Oh, they, oh, sorry. Yeah, you're talking partial. about me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Way off. <Hello. laughs> His name was Martin. I just said, oh yeah. Just had my 82nd birthday. Oh, oh. To the podcast. <laughs> um, this guy on the in the question. Yeah, is Hersh Marvin. 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 He's uh, he's a little bit younger, and maybe this is his is his, his one true boy to die to lead to a third Welsh. <laughs> no. Oh, no. Ah. oh. Don't say I'm fucking scared of the moon. I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. That's perfect. Pirate on LSD. I don't understand what that was. <laughs> so the thing is, Ooh, there's a, a pirate door. <laughs> yeah. 
hey. Welcome, so friends. People are going to be coming in and out. <laughs> it's fun. It's casual. It's friendly. Sure. Let's Only make sure this... that never happens again, though. <laughs> <laughs> Anything can happen at the South by Southwest Platinum Premium of Video Of course, but let's lounge. make sure it never does. All right, <laughs> man. Next but up, let's, let's do this one, more, one time before we... Let's move on after we take a vote, because there's there's about like Ooh. nine people no, in this room. No, let's just move on. All right, okay, question right. number two. No, no, no. Let's take a vote. Let's take a vote. Would you have a, would think, you have a talk? I think well, you can bring it up. Just don't do... Just If you if you feel like it's going to start off with like, hey, man, we need to talk, then you're doing it. The question it. is right. this. You bring live in New York. Find a new friend. You live in New York, and you they have a friend who lives in L.A., and he, and he has a girlfriend in New York, and he visits the girl. I got more, though. Okay. It, you can't give We're him the... We're not going to un- address the, this? <laughs> <laughs> That's just gonna be fine. So bizarre. <laughs> we can't. God, it got your attention. You can't <laughs> tell him though to sort of be like, "I need to see more time with. I need to have more time with you." That's weird. You can just sort of express it and say, "Hey, man, I miss you." Yeah. I miss oh, you. Oh, bollocks, mate. <laughs> nice. Thanks. I I can't see you because I'm cleaning cleaning them chimneys. <laughs> We're. Dog shit. <laughs> yeah, man. I, I cannot see you, man. I cannot see you, man. Wait, so what's the vote? Oh, uh, um, have a conversation versus find a new friend. All right, so have a conversation. Raise your hand. Two, women. three, four. Thank you, women. Well, we, they're all off camera, so one. Two, three, four. Uh, find a new friend. Oh, wow, four. Shit, Even it's split. legit split. But I want the first group. It was all ladies and a tender man. <laughs> I think it's safe to say he's a tenderman. Well, yeah. Brian so th- tenderman. this question came from a dude about a dude. So all the dudes, they voted no conversation, find a new friend. The question, the, the podcast is, what would you do if you were you, if I were you? So you, okay. Thomas, so would have a So there's no wrong I mean, answer. So there's no yeah. answer to there's give There's definitely him. no Flip wrong answer, coin. but I got the answer that was corroborated <laughs> no, no, no. by Flip the most people. chilling. <laughs> what would you, you would have a talk, you would not. I would probably not. I think it's okay to express it, but you just can't be like, "Hey, I, I want to. Sp- I need to spend more, spend more time with you." Da da da. Because then that's just like that's intense. Yeah, it's and intense. it makes him feel bad for having a lady friend. Yeah, and he shouldn't. You should be happy that he's found love. That's what I'm saying. It's just a little backward. I know. Be- I understand. <laughs> okay. And I'll get it next time. Okay. Thank and you. And after so a much. joke, right? Yeah. New just question wait for the punchline. New question. Uh, let's get a round of applause. It's fun to have applause. Yeah, that was good. <laughs> Why oh, not? Wow. Applause break. <laughs> we can sort of ask for whatever. Yeah. I you know it's weird is cause you had to ask this, for this it? is all this is weird. <laughs> like we're chatting, like, oh, oh. we're having a conversation. The weed brownie. But it, you. there's this. Gotcha. Yeah, yeah, man. <laughs> it's like the bachelor. <laughs> oh no 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 no. Let yes, me read yes, this yes, guy. Oh, <laughs> He's not in it for love. He's in it for the wrong reasons. Get that right. right reasons. Yeah. Yeah. This is season. Okay, okay, so, so <laughs> no, there no, are there's like <laughs> He's matched on to me. I love it. There's, okay, so we're having a conversation. Welcome, Yay. welcome, welcome. And then, but then it's intimate. It's about advice, and there's and the, and then every time you glance over, there's people watching. Yeah, yeah. Because usually when we record this, a lot of people hear it, but we don't actually see them here. No, it's in a room. It's a, it's in your solarium. Of course. Uh, all right, we're gonna ask uh, or sorry, answer another questions. Um, 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 um. um, 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 um um, 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 um. All right, this one is from a college dude. Can you give us a name and read the question like a college dude? Oh, uh, Riley Krylison? <laughs> <laughs> Riley writes. Yeah, Riley writes. Hey, dudes, what's up? This past fall, I moved into a college apartment with my two bros yeah. from back home in brackets and a random fourth roommate who's never here. <laughs> Since it is a college apartment, we don't have much room to make the space our own. I just need you to do an apostrophe after D-O-N and before T, thanks. (laughs) We have a couple posters up, some lights, pretty typical (laughs) college stuff. Somewhat. I hope that I hope that has nothing to do with the rest. He just wants you to know that. Don't worry. Is <laughs> on the there. Like, like, like we're oh, close. Yeah, <laughs> Black like, lights or whatever. Um, it's decent. It's like eight out of ten. <laughs> <laughs> um, recently, after we got back from winter break, we had the idea to decorate Your a. Lips blank. are so tight. <laughs> yeah, man. Get it tight, man. I fucked like thirty girls, like skin ten. Uh, <laughs> To decorate a blank wall with pictures we draw, Drew. Huh? 
<laughs> it could be draw. <laughs> Pictures we draw. Say yeah, that last draw. sentence one more time. Re- this is uh, the crux of the story. Recently, short. after we got back from winter break, we had the idea to decorate a blank wall with pictures we draw. Okay, sure. It fucks me up. I think it's true, right? Yeah. Drew Carey. <laughs> Nonsense. Continue. <laughs> That's no. He wrote that. No. Um, With the I, notes. I thought it was pretty cool. I thought it was a pretty cool idea, and it looked cool at first. But now our wall is almost completely completely full with art we aren't master artists each still each piece looks cool by itself but looking at the whole wall it just looks like crazy people scribbling and taping art to walls my roommate thinks it's pretty dope still i've grown to dislike it (laughs) this is the best i feel weird about inviting people over especially girls i'm interested in and, and having them see a whole wall of drug-induced art. I think a couple of pictures would be all right, but it's come to the point where we're overlapping and just looks tacky slash lame to me. I wish, we'd, I wish we'd take down most of them and leave only a few of the really cool ones up. Is there any way I could bring this up to my roommates without get them getting mad at me? These guys have been my best friends since grade school. <laughs> Except for the fourth guy. And Random. They, and, they still re- and they are still really into putting pictures up, and I've spent tons of time doing so. So I feel like a jerk if I just straight up ask them to take it down. <laughs> Signed, <laughs> Riley Krylerson. All right. Great job. Thank well, you. Riley. God, I don't want you to be anybody but that guy for the rest of your life. <laughs> Dude, later on you can get this pretty sick fatty burrito. <laughs> really? Yeah, man. They mash the rice up so it's kind of like a like a chewy rice paste. <laughs> then they put grilled zucchinis and onions in there. <laughs> Riley, Riley. Dude, no, I'm serious. Yeah, they put like nu- like nutritional yeast, like new <laughs> all up in there. Yeah. <laughs> they sprinkle yeah, a little tasty. diet cheese. Completely <laughs> vegan. Really? You're a yeah, vegan yeah. frat boy. Yeah, dude. But I still slay puss. <laughs> Isn't that meat? Yeah, <laughs> sick. I guess I am a carnivore. You gotta go, put him tits. Absolutely. <laughs> All right. Uh, <laughs> Even Riley knows. <laughs> uh, what an ins- what an insane small stakes, high stakes problem. So he's like. <laughs> I thought it'd be chill if we put art up, and now it's like, oh, this art's actually not chill. Let's take them all down except for the chillest ones, which are probably yeah. the ones he drew. It's I don't know. Know. <laughs> I could see that being a good idea, and then when, like, in high, when it's all up, you're like, look at all them crazy yeah. man scribbles. Oh, shit, that makes... There was a time when I was in high school. I had the basement. It was kind of chill. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, so, um, and? My parents had <laughs> me paint this room in the basement, and I thought it was going to be really cool to like put... Um, paint on my hands and put handprints all over the wall Ooh, okay. and I thought I'd be like alright that's kind of cool that's kind of artsy that's yeah. chill and then I did that and then like every time I was downstairs in the basement alone there's just like handprints handprints everywhere I felt like I was gonna get you're killed. like a madman <laughs> yeah yeah it was really scary so, so ha- riddle me this riddle me that <laughs> <laughs> but it's like that only your friends did the handprints and you wanted to paint over them I feel like well, I guess I, what I'm saying is like it's all gonna be fine I think you could you're gonna leave this place in so short of a time. Yeah. I also think you can bring it up, but you got to respect democracy. Like, if you bring it up, like, dudes, are we sure we want to... Just, I don't really love I, this it anymore. Like not even democracy? It's like, I feel like it's got to be unanimous. Maybe, yeah. But, but what if, if, what if, if he says, the, what if he goes, I don't know if I place. like this anymore, and including the fourth weirdo, they're all like, what are you talking about, right. Riley? <laughs> well, that's, you have to go to every single conversation with a very open mind. Be like, hey, look... So he's got a he he could talk to his roommates with no expectation of this shit is coming down. I have yeah. a good idea. But okay, go ahead. You talk to one that's the most on the fence, and you start to tip the scales in your favor. Ooh, it's so unimportant. So you like, so like you like get one on you your side, and it's like oh me me and Brody wall, like, were talking about it, and we don't really like it anymore. Suddenly it's two on two. One on three is a little intimidating because you're in Riley. the minority. Yeah, Brody Riley. Who are the other two roommates? Oh, there's Brody, there's Riley, there's Taylor, and then there's Stream. And fucking, <laughs> we stream. never see that dude. <laughs> stream. Yeah. Stream. Are you sure you live with him? His dude, name's on the you, list. Is Stream. If you've yeah. never seen him. Yeah, man. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> What are you saying? That's exactly what I'm saying. Have you ever seen him? No. And he is your roommate, though. Yeah. Does he pay I, rent? Yeah. <laughs> really? How does it arrive, the rent? I don't know. It's just on the kitchen table. But his dad's a guarantor. Yeah. What's his dad's name? Corner. <laughs> <laughs> 
corner base for streams rent you've never seen stream and there's a check once a month dude From it's corner. awesome it's like we have three people living in a four person spot man sure why are you guys pissed at this you're pissed. just jelly dude soups gel we're not jelly. I'm Yo, just trying man, to put a light up because you could be the gel over it the what the gel i took I a bit of stagecraft. <laughs> You accidentally took it to a Hollywood thing. I was thinking theater, but whatever. Good man. The boards, the boards. <laughs> Guys, check week was hell. But I was outside at intermission. I know, bad, bad. People are talking. <laughs> Any theater uh, students listening to that would be like, yay! I'm laughing and I didn't yeah, did it. Ice cold. Dude. Ice cold. Um, I think it's a very you just I just bring it up like hey do we want this I want to bring You're I want to bring you don't like so I would just take whack. down a couple of things I didn't like and oh, one at like, a time one a day who got rid of the of the <clears throat> shit that I drew no no like, I don't know that's bad news <laughs> you, <laughs> you start <laughs> fires with that because then it's like another hey, Matt, option I like that one. I no, you don't get it, dude. That one was my favorite. That was my favorite too. I'm pissed that it's gone. <laughs> you took it down. No, I didn't, man. <laughs> Who did? I think it was stream. Stream. <laughs> stream. Stream comes in, sneaks in in the middle of the night, leaves a check, and takes a picture down. <laughs> Who took it down? I don't know. It must have been Stream. <laughs> you know Stream. That's how I you don't bro- know. Him. That's how you wrote never wrote met him. Everybody else, like, hey, man, I think these art, like these art pieces, are really cool. Stream hates them. Yeah. yeah. Stream, blame it on the fourth weirdo. So what would you do if I were you? If I were you, I'd just I'd just be like, uh, I'm dudes, bros, I love you, and this is I, I'm kinda losing interest in these in the in this. It looks like a crazy person. I want to bring puss over here and slay it. Yeah. Can you imagine a college girl seeing that and being turned off? Like yeah. I think college girls are, are used to like this the guy, most like, absolute squalor. I can't imagine art to have like that. really really refined taste or something yeah. he's in college like just figuring out for the first time that he doesn't like random he's bringing over like a 38 year old museum docent <laughs> to their house he's ashamed <laughs> that shannon from the met is gonna see it oh no dudes how did you even meet this 38 year old intelligent highly intelligent docent you're 21 <laughs> and shannon's like no 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 i get it <laughs> I get what you've done here. Whoa. Have me. I want you all to have me. On no. top of his bad art. No. <laughs> Righteous. Uh, <laughs> Bill and Ted's. Uh, so, so you would bring it up? Yeah, why not? I mean, if, 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 don't bottle it in, boys. I would bottle it in? This is the second bottle it in advice. <laughs> That's true. I, I would just, How do you function? I'd start pinning, man. I would just be like... Thinking about my new place outside of like no more like no three roommates and just just me pinning. You mean having a Pinterest mood board? Yeah, dude, I have a Pinterest. This guy's twenty one and in college. He's not going solo for a while. Dude, I went. I was solo when I was twenty one. Yeah. What do you mean? Yeah. (laughs) (laughs) You said that like it wasn't. Yeah. Yeah, but you you had a ton of art that you drew on the wall. You know, not everyone's top shelf premium dollar bill screen bats fat stacks, Mr. White. Excuse me. <laughs> I, I was broke. My father paid for my apartment. Yeah, yeah exactly. <laughs> I know. I'm just kidding. Well, Thanks, Daddy. <laughs> but, um, Tish. Yep. That was just a that sort was just of a, a boom. Oh, sorry. Got it. Okay. Next and time. And again, punchline. Wait for that. Absolutely. <laughs> Your acknowledgement is like a wet mouth movement. Red and Stimpy. <laughs> New question? Is it time? Let's do one more. Almost did it. Uh, let's one take more? a break and then do one more question. We'll be right back with Tommy. And we're back with Tommy. Yes. <laughs> that was fun. What did you think of the commercial break? <laughs> Man, I can't wait to buy whatever that was. I absolutely. 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 Do you have anything you wanted to plug? (laughs) What a weird Uh, time it was for me to ask that. There's a bunch. Okay. You got Silicon Valley coming out April 12th. HBO. Season two. Yeah. Yeah. HBO right after Game of Thrones. You got, if you if you have Disney XD or even if you just want to buy it on iTunes, there's Pen Zero Part-Time Hero. Great for kids, but me as an adult. I love it. I'm the voice of Penn. I'm a oh. part-time hero. I zap in and out of dimensions with <laughs> my best friends. I thought you were just friends. plugging something that you kind of liked on your own. <laughs> it's a cartoon. It's real fun. Also. Jesus Christ, you're a busy guy. Eh. 
<laughs> we do just this. <laughs> just yeah. this, a new show on MTV2. Also, <laughs> also on Saturdays, I'll be trolling for Dion Hollywood Boulevard dressed as a lady. <laughs> Um, but what else? What else? Uh, I just, I tell you this. I just started a Twitch uh, account where I'm now, playing Tell video. me about that. Now, what is that? God, your voice sucks. <laughs> You're nervous. <laughs> <laughs> what is a Twitch? I'm, Twitch? I want one of these now. This is me now, I think. <laughs> That's how you Whenever you You're taking that out to flat. Austin tonight. <laughs> is there a world where I can put this in my mouth? Absolutely Put this not. in the small of my back and just... I think people would know it. Mini magnifique thing, dang, ding, 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 ding. That's my Missy Elliott. That's how out of touch I am with hip hop. Uh, sorry, what is Wait, it, Twitch? Twitch, Twitch. If you don't know Twitch TV, it's essentially YouTube for video games. I mean, pretty much you watch, you log onto someone's channel, and watch them play video games, or talk about video games, or whatever. It's like gameplay with maybe a little inlay of, you know, a webcam footage or whatever. Some people have full-on productions. It would just be me. I've already done a session of Total War Attila. What? Yeah. What is that game? This is Deep Cuts Nerd. Only people who are like into PC gaming will know. Anybody what I'm know what this means? Wow. And we are in a, we are in a room full of the, computer programmers and like, yeah. hell no, yeah. I would not do that They're shit. They're busy doing Someone just Vimeos. yelled out loser from the back as he was talking. <laughs> well, a ninety pound white kid. Here's the cool thing is like how, how Twitch functions is you like subscribe to someone's channel and that's money that gets you know, split between Twitch and the and the user. Credit. Oh, how much does it cost to subscribe to your channel? I think I don't know. Th that's this will be the first time I've sort of worked it out with. Oh, Twitch you can choose you, a like, channel. You figure it out. I think. Which, I don't really know. I'm learning. I'm learning. Gotcha. But what I, what's cool? What I've just what I've what I what I'm more excited about is the majority of anything that gets subscribed to me. I'm going to donate to charities, environmental charities, which happens to be a passion of mine. So watch out, Sierra Club. You're getting two hundred dollars. <laughs> <laughs> Why do they have to watch out? Watch out. What? Better make way in the bank account. <laughs> oh, you think there's a maximum? Yeah, you better shove some of those gold coins aside. Is that you think it's a physical a space and they're going to run out of room? Maybe. No, absolutely it sounds like not. you're angry and you don't want to help the charity. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> you're it's so half a 200, so uh -huh, 100. Oh, that's even less likely to fill up their bank account. Is it? Yeah, of course. <laughs> so that's what I'm... I'm so how can they find that? About. Twitch what? Twitch. Oh, it's the same as my um, t Twitter handle is Middle Ditch. So you just go into Twitch and you look up the username Middle Ditch. After I made that, what about Middle many, Twitch? Many, many users were like, you should have done Middle Twitch. And I was like, yeah, I should have. I'm an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> but now it's nice and simple. Middle Ditch for, for all. Yeah, Middle Ditch for all. Yes. True. That's so my policy. It was it was fun the first time. I mean, you, you like no one knows what Total War is and all that kind of stuff. Yeah. I had like, you know, like... A tw tw 1,200 people watching Jesus this. Jesus Christ. They put it on the main page. It got linked to Kotaku, Kotaku if you don't know that. It got that. linked to Kotaku? Kotaku! Are you kidding me? Oh! <laughs> yeah, man. It was no, but fun. seriously, like, it's a I... very popular video game blog. <laughs> he came. It's coming out. Yeah. No, no, it's there. Um, and, and, you know, I, you do a show at like UCB or, or whatever that's, you know, maybe yeah. 100, 200 or something. You know, I managed to reach out and connect with uh, a bunch of people. And it was really fun. Everybody was like praising the nerdiness and I liked it. That's I felt awesome. at home. So did they watch you while you play or they just see your screen? They just saw my screen because I didn't have a webcam at that point. What so they just talking? saw game gameplay and me chatting and gabbing and talking in stupid voices. Holy shit. I'd watch that. Yeah, it was fun. You didn't even have to play a video game. I'd just watch you chat to me or if I called you right, I'd man. Like, okay right. chat to me <laughs> <laughs> hey man mm. uh, next question yeah <laughs> anything else that's it those are the big three those are the big ones yeah why not yeah uh, alright cool thank you you are, are you ready to answer one last question do you have time yeah, I'm, I'm this here is to Austin bro yeah dude we're here at the Platinum you Premium yes. Cameo <laughs> Lounge yeah in five minutes we got Reggie Watts <laughs> <laughs> DJ building up a guy who's never, ever, ever coming. Uh, nice. <laughs> hey, man. Nice. You got the voice of a goddamn angel. <laughs> An angel who can sort of sing all right. Yeah, okay. We need a guy's name. Three guys in a row. Three guys. Do you want to read this question? Huh? Do you want to read this question? Sure. His name, though, is... Jake Hurwitz. Oh my oh, G. Oh shit. 
Okay. <clears throat> Hi, guys. I'm a huge fan of the show, and I'm excited. I finally have a problem to get fixed by you guys. To give some context, I am in my second year of college. I had pretty low self-esteem through high school and my first year of college, but this past semester, I started working out and taking some pretty chill antidepressants. My man. Yeah, baby. Yeah. And now I realize I'm a freaking pimp. Oh, cool. This realization happened pretty late last semester, so I hooked up with two girls. One from Tinder, so thanks for the heads up, Jake. Huh? Now I just started into, he wrote that. Now I just started into this relationship, my first real one ever. We met in one of my classes about three weeks ago. I really like this girl. She's amazing, talented, sweet, funny. The hmm. problem is, I don't know if I'm actually ready to be in a relationship right now. I still want to experience different girls. And if I wasn't in a relationship, I have at least three girls that I could hook up with within the week. Nasty. I know. <laughs> that was like Paul Abdul. <laughs> 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 uh, uh, uh. She has had horrible experiences with guys in the past, and I don't want to hurt her. Easy. But I also I feel like all these new is. exciting experiences are passing me by. Plus, it might be pretty awkward seeing her in class three times a week if I broke up with her. What should I do? Sincerely, Jake, Jake Hurwitz. Hurwitz. <laughs> Let's give it up for Jake Hurwitz. Hey, all yeah. right, Jakey. Um, so this guy used to be depressed. Ah. <laughs> Now he's not the depressants, Dude. boss. Now he's congratulations so on taking life by the horns and getting out of that that stinky world. First and foremost, yeah, yeah, been yeah. there, man. It's good to it's, get out. You're a butter, you're mm. a beautiful butterfly now, and no more caterpillar days for you. So great job. That being said, that being said, <laughs> don't be selfish. <laughs> don't no what. He's being selfish. He wants to have his cake and eat it too. He wants to break hearts and slam tarts. And no, no, no. <laughs> if you're going to the oven, you're baking, you're staying in the kitchen. You're not going to run around and go to restaurants. Oh. I don't understand. <laughs> he wants he wants to he wants to all, fall in love and hit it and quit it with all the other dames. And unless she's cool with that, I mean, come on. Well, she's not cool with it, but yeah, all right, well. She won't be cool with it. She's been burned. Not. She's a tender flower. She's a tender flower. Here's the sentence that I think is the most insightful. Uh, I still want to experience different girls, and if I wasn't in a relationship, I'd have I would have had at least three girls that I could hook up with within the week. My man. Seems like he's just thinking about the three girls he could have hooked up also, with. Also, if he could hook up with three girls within a week, he's not fully invested in his relationship. <laughs> yeah. No, yeah. That means that takes work. Yeah, it's Wait, hard he's to... currently in the relationship with he's the He's in a relationship. Oh, he's, he's currently in? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh. He's got a girlfriend. He thinks he can fuck three girls within seven days. Let I me... think that you're like not paying enough attention to your girlfriend. Let me then. also say a little bit of this. It's total grass is greener. When you get into a relationship, suddenly you have the confidence you wish you had when you were single. Oh. I and mean, that always happens. Explain you that. You suddenly <clears throat> have your relationship, and you're like, oh, good. And then, like... You you suddenly feel that like that's the only barrier for you having like eight threesomes all the time, which is like not really the case. It's closer to, closer to six threesomes. I mean, probably. hello, <laughs> do the man. He's so, he's in college. He's feeling. Con- he's on yeah. antidepressants for the first time. He shouldn't lock himself up with I, a girl. I, I agree. I agree. I think you should break up with this girl, but not hurt her. Just in a nice, polite way to say I you, I say, think you're great and you deserve somebody who can be fully invested in this relationship. And I'm not so. I'm going to go away and try bone. to f- uh, have sex with... Well, he wouldn't say this last no. part, but try yeah. to have sex with three, three girls, girls in seven days. days. I mean, that's a goddamn no record! Three girls in a week? Are you the kidding math? me? Oh, that's only that's four days of breath! <laughs> that's what I'm saying. No, no, no. It could be seven. So it could be one girl for more than one day. Dude, you never know. I you know. could be fucking all day, every day. <laughs> so what would that look like? <laughs> if you're not letting you... If you're not letting... No, 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 no. Oh, my God. YOLO, YOLO, YOLO. Yo, check it out. <laughs> I think you can totally explain what he said in the email. Yo, I just cocooned. I have, like... I, I've been I've been in the dark world, and now it's a renaissance, and I, I, I like you a lot, but, I, I, you know, I gotta go learn like, the enlightenment. What is this, What he's saying, essentially, is I'm a butterfly for the first time. Should I not fly? Let me... Yeah. I'm a and peacock, saying, let no. me fly. Yeah. We're well, saying, peacocks course, can't fly, so pe- that doesn't do not make fly. sense. Like, have you not seen the other guys? But a peacock will... They'll, <laughs> they'll fly and they'll fuck. You know, a peacock, a peacock will, will do that thing with the big feathers. And yeah, I of course. If he's got the feathers, you should show them to yeah, people. Yeah, he's burning bright, baby. Let the moths come to the flame. And I do mean, come, hit it. 
This is our show. Thank you so much for watching. It was If I Were You with Thomas Middleton. Hey, oh, hey. Thomas. Hey. Take us out. I'm taking you out. Yeah. Let's do it. Let's sing, man. No, no, no. Take me out to dinner. Oh, okay. Well, yeah. Well, but then, first, a song. A, a piece of just, okay. Uh, auntie. Thank you. Thank you. For listening. Thank you. Welcome in to your own ears. We've come in and we've brought spears. We want your head. Stop at nothing. Someone do my laundry. <laughs> Shit, we're going to murder everybody in this house. Thomas, thanks so much for coming by. And thank you to Vimeo for always. having us. Namaste. And thanks to Vimeo. Thanks to Bethany and Alex Sexton. What time? Uh, we'll be back soon. Good night, everybody. <laughs> People are talking. <laughs> All right, great. Thank you. Thanks so much.